Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you are coming across an error on Google Chrome, where it says that there is not enough memory to open this page. So this should hopefully be a fairly straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we're going to go ahead and start off by opening up the Start menu. Type in Advanced System. and best results should come back with view advanced system settings go ahead and left click on that underneath the performance visual effects processor scheduling memory usage and virtual memory go ahead and select the settings button now that you're here go ahead and left click on the advanced tab select the change button that corresponds underneath virtual memory and now that you are here, you want to go ahead and uncheck the option where it says automatically manage paging file size for all drivers. And then once that is done, you want to go select custom size here. Now for initial size in megabytes, I usually would not set it any less than one and a half times or no more than three times the amount of RAM that's installed on the computer. So there's literally one gigabyte of RAM on this computer. So I'm actually going to just go in the middle. So there's 1024 megabytes in a gigabyte. So 1024 times 2 is 2048. So that's what I'm going to set it as here. Again, this will be different. You will see different guides on different channels and even on my channel where I actually will put different values in here from time to time. But generally speaking, I'm just going to jump right in the middle. That's what I'm feeling like for this tutorial. And I'm actually going to just set the maximum size just for the same value here too. I'm not going to set it anymore. I'm just going to do 2048. And then once I'm done setting that, again, you can type whatever you want. I'm not going to go too high, though. To go too high, in your case, this number is probably going to be a lot bigger if you have like 4 gigabytes of RAM, 8 gigabytes of RAM. So instead of multiplying 1 gigabyte of RAM times 1024, you might be multiplying 4 times 1024, or 8 times 1024. So that's what the main difference is here. So the numbers can definitely get a lot bigger. I'm just showing you guys in my case here. So once I'm done with that, I'm going to go ahead and select OK. You will need to restart your computer for the changes to take effect. Go ahead and select OK again. Apply and OK. We're going to select OK. We will need to restart our computer, so select Restart Now and give it a moment here.
Okay, there you go guys. At this point you should be able to launch Google Chrome and then hopefully that error message will no longer be prevalent. So, as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope that I was able to help you out and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.